the USD CAD. Uh, the previous signal for the USD CAD was for the sell, and we were just uh, were waiting for the candles to reach this resistance level because before we start shorting the uh, USD CAD. Now this game has changed because of this bullish candle here, and we can see that the market has reversed from the support level. And the thing we can see here is strong bullish candles, and now this support level is gonna be respected and is gonna be acting as a support as well. So, in my opinion, the USD CAD is good for the buy. Uh, we just need to wait for the right moment to start buying the USD CAD. Go back to the daily candles. Going back to the daily candles and reading these candles, what we can see here, we can see that the, the pair has actually made a full reversal recreating, uh, representing the resistance number one. And then fall down here, we can see that now the next reversal is attempt uh, to create a resistance number two. So from my point of view, the USD CAD is going to fall again a little bit. Let me just mark that this support level here is my entry point. And from that level here, when this support level become again a new support level, we are going to actually buy the USD CAD right on, that, uh, on the spot. So go back now to the four hour chart. And let's just be more accurate uh, about our entry. And we can see right here, let me just show you. I'm looking here at the support level. I'm just going to actually set my line right on this level, right here like that. And therefore, we can see that on Friday night, the candle has closed as a doji. And we can expect the market to make a small reversal. This is going to be really good level to start buying the pair. Uh, because we can see here that we had also a strong support in the past. And here it was also a resistance. Good. Let me just uh, give you the possibilities that we can expect the pair to fall a little bit more down against you just to complete the form on this support there uh, zone here. Uh, it might actually fall here inside the support zone. I mean, that is not uh, much actually. I think less than 10 pips. Yeah, 11, 10 pips. And then it's going to start hopefully the bullish reversal. So. If, it, if this happens, how far can we keep our trade, our trade running? Uh, look at the left, we can see that here we have a strong resistance level, which was as well a strong support. That is a good level that, that we can expect the pair to actually start falling right after hitting it. Or we need to see the price action to decide, of course. However, that is going to be a really good level to set our tech profit level. So if we start buying the USD CAD right on this support level, keep the trade running for almost uh, 87, uh, sorry, 78 pips. Hopefully it's going to be good profit for everyone. And let me just now mark the levels for you. So we can start buy the pair on the level 1.304.33. And our take profit guys right on the previous support. Let me just write the levels for you as well. So our take profit is gonna be uh, 1.311. Sorry, what is that? 3.1198. So uh, this is uh, again that's my analysis for the USD CAD. Hopefully it's gonna be a good week for everyone. And uh, in the end, I would like to thank you for watching.